you like getting that? get involved in the kick return game. Uh, when was the last time you were able to, to, to do that? Uh, I returned a little bit in Indianapolis. Um, but it, when we went in for halftime and Ock came up to me, like, you ever return kicks? I was like, yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm good. So he let me go out there and make a couple of plays. So I just want to build on that. You're a guy who has vertical speed. How much does, does that specific talent help in the return game? It helps a lot. You know what I mean? Not too much dancing around. You want to make one cut and go best that you can. And just trusting the guys in front of me, you know what I mean? The the holes that open up, uh, just vision. I think a lot of it is speed and vision. Would you be a candidate for, for punt returns uh, as well? You ever you do much of that at all? No, nah, I'm going to be honest. I hadn't done punt returns. I feel like I'd be hurting the team more to help them if I just jumped out there for that. So uh, I was I was good with kickoff return, not punt. What is it like as a kick returner when you got everybody coming at you? And what, what are those things you need to do right when you catch the ball uh, as far as having a successful return? You have to be decisive. I mean, that's that's really that's all I can really say about it. You got to be decisive and trust your teammates that uh, they're going to make their blocks and you just make the right cut off of them. What's the challenge this week against the Chiefs and, uh, you know, and what you've seen on, on film? Uh, as far as kickoff return or just defense? Or defensively what they do as a defense to, to challenge offense? I think it's the same thing, man. These last few weeks has really been uh, – just winning man coverage, you know what I mean? And converting on third downs and in the red zone. So our mindset is when they're up front, they're pressing us, uh, we take that personal, we get open, we create separation. And I think that's going to be the, the big thing for the receivers this week. Keep beating man coverage, keep making contested catches. So what's the challenge on a, sh on a short week from a physical standpoint, maybe from a mental standpoint, how do you think, how do you think you guys have handled it? I think they've done a great job. I think the coaches did a great job planning this week for us, you know what I mean, getting us right physically. And then we're always locked in mentally, you know what I'm saying, knowing the game, playing what we need to do, knowing our roles, and uh, it'll show up on Sunday. It's sympathy for AJ this week because he tries to battle back from the, the food uh, business there. You know, I still don't know the whole story behind that. I need to I need to ask him. I know that it was a rumor going around it was Chipotle. I got I got a lot of love for Chipotle. <laughs> I'm not going to put that out there. I don't know. So uh, the good thing is, <laughs> right, they, man, they need to holler at me, come talk to me. <laughs> I haven't, thank God. And I don't, wanna, I don't even know what that's like. So I, yeah. AJ said that it shook him so much, he said he's going to give up fast food. What's, what's your diet? I mean, are you a fast food guy? I'm conscious. I, I really am, especially during the season. Uh, I'm not a big fat, uh, fast food person, but. Uh, I'm not going to say I just give it all up. I think maybe that's just for the season he's saying that. I'm sure once the all season kick in, he'll ease back over to wherever his spots are for some fast food, for sure. You, you say you like Chipotle. What's your, what's your thing? Like, what, do you, what do you get when you go there? Tacos, the uh, hard shell tacos, or a bowl, a bowl, yeah. Marcus, when you came back from injury a couple of weeks ago, you sort of slid right in and, and, and were productive. How much was maybe your availability during training camp and the preseason, that, did, did that help you to be able to do that? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was all coming off of training camp. Uh, and for me, it was mental. Uh, the guys did a great job um, helping me in the uh, weight room, Frank, Brian, Mondre, getting me ready and staying prepared, staying in shape. So for me, mentally, it was like, man, I have to come in and contribute immediately. You know what I'm saying? So uh, obviously during those weeks, you just kind of study, you stay to yourself. I'm not able to be around the team a whole lot. So staying in the playbook. So I was thankful that worked. And I feel like I'm a versatile player. It showed up against the Bills going in a kickoff return. Uh, Jacksonville had to step up at X. So uh, just being able to move around, that, that's been the big key.